Hi, I'm at my desk, my office, and I'm about to dig into my work. And I just thought I, I wanted to share with you um, an experience I just had today. I went to a Qigong class, or it might actually be Qigong. I'm not sure what I'm talking about. So if there's anybody out there who actually knows what it's called, please tell me if I'm right or wrong. But this, this class um, talked about what is the basis of a lot of martial arts. And it is this balance of yin and yang energy, or you could call it male and female energy. It's this, this feeling inside of you that you're really heavy and calm and grounded, rooted into the earth. Um, while at the same time being uplifted, like almost like you're growing from some like rich, deep soil, like you're growing, you're rising, you're doing, it's a doing quality. That's the yang energy. So it's having this balance at all times. And on like a, on a life scale, I realized that as a society today, we are like very much stuck in the yang energy, meaning we are like looking at our to-do list with our mind, like going circles, um, thinking about everything that has to be done and taking action all the time. And just, we're kind of caught on that, that wheel. Um, and it needs to be broken because without that balance, the energy, like literally physically isn't flowing through our body. And that can be the basis for a lot of illnesses. So it's definitely a challenge that I face on the road, finding this balance of, um, you know, working and doing the where's my office now videos and, and going biking and, and just doing all this stuff, like finding the balance of that with relaxing, calm, just enjoyment, like, like feeling heavy, feeling grounded. So it's definitely a challenge, but I think we can all do it, especially if we just get outside in nature and do things without without like an, an end goal, maybe just go out and say, okay, I'm going to go walk around in nature. I'm going to sit down when I feel like sitting down and really just taking your time with it, with that moment. Um, I think we need it. We definitely need it. So it was a really interesting experience and I thought I would share it. Um, let me show you my office view right now. It's, it's out there. It's the beautiful red rocks. I love Sedona. Um, Corey's out uh, guiding a, a mountain biking tour right now, so that's pretty sweet. Um, stay tuned. We have episode... I have a bruise on my arm from biking. Yeah. Falling into a rock and a tree at the same time. Yeah, so yes, we have episode 7 coming really soon, so stay tuned. Um, and I hope that you all have a great, balanced day. Uh, peace.